Hi, I'm David Kronk. I am the Technical Director for Physical Security for Annexter. So you're deciding what credential technology you want to use, which is the right one. And we use a case methodology. We look at four criteria. We look at convenience, acceptability, or as it, is it acceptable as a security technology or at the security level. We look at speed and accuracy and we also look at the environment. So as we look at this, this fingerprint, finger vein reader, as we use this, it, it's actually taking my fingerprint and our finger vein, putting it together as, a, as my biometric credential, and then it's sending that information to the access control system. So as we use this reader, Thank you. You have been identified. it's pretty quick, isn't it? It has the capability of being able to give you access using your iris as your biometric credential, but not having to touch it. So with this, you have the capability of doing dual authentication or having two forms of identification, something I possess and something that I am. This reader here is a wave reader. It's actually reading all four of my fingers at the same time, very high security. But its main thing is that it's very fast. So this reader here is actually completely weather resistant. You can, it could be rained on, snowed on. It has a very large sensor, fingerprint sensor. It's very loud. Access granted. So it has the capability of being used in outdoor applications. So this reader here has the capability of measuring 40,000 points on your face. It creates a 3D biometric template and matches that against your live biometric. So we can pre present our credential at the data cabinet and be able to use that. Thank you for virtually visiting our Glenview lab here at Annexter. If you have any more questions on biometrics or would like to come see our biometric showcase, please contact your local Annexter representative.